missed me and we're here with another episode of yoga for beginners and in this quick little episode I want to show you how or just share with you how you can set up a home practice if you're new to yoga so it really is a lot more simple than you make it you need just enough space really for your body to lie down and so that typically is about the size of a yoga mat and then just enough room maybe that you can raise your arms so I'm lucky I have an open an open bedroom um, that I've just taken, but you can practice in your living room. I know people who practice in their hallway. You just need enough space that you can lie a yoga mat down. Now in the discussion of yoga mats, I am really particular about having a good yoga mat. Now you don't need to spend a ton of money, but do make sure that you're getting a mat that has a little bit of grip so that your hands and your feet aren't slipping. If you're slipping in the middle of your practice, going to make your um, growth and your evolution of your skills a lot harder and it will make your practice not so enjoyable. I also suggest getting yourself some props. A yoga block is great and then if you don't have a yoga block you can honestly just use like a rolled up towel or a really big book <laughs> if you happen to have a book that's that thick. Um, and then a yoga strap or even just a um, the belt to a robe or even just a belt is really nice because we can't always reach our feet or, or even reach our hands behind our back. So really a space that's just big enough for your body and a yoga mat that is a little bit grippy to help you stay on your mat. And then if you're able to, you can grab yourself a, a yoga block or a strap. And then really you're ready to rock and roll. So then finding a teacher that you enjoy their teachings. I would suggest if you're a beginner, starting with a restorative or a really gentle hatha or even a yin practice, but not jumping into a power flow or a really high energy, speedy practice. It's gonna be really important that you first learn proper alignment and how to move your body in a safe way and how to breathe properly for your practice. So checking out a couple of teachers I'm one of them, <laughs> I'd be happy to support you and really just enjoy your practice. This is just the art of connecting your body to your breath and moving in a way that feels safe, strong and capable. Sending you so much love. Don't forget to subscribe to our page so you get updated on all of our new videos. And if you liked this one, of course, go ahead and give it a like so that I know and I will see you next time. Sending you love.